What's up everybody, your boy the E-Bike Guy here, and today we're going to be doing a ride. We got the Step Bummer 5000 watt version right here. As you know, last time I did an 8000 watt uh, Step Bummer ride video. So we're going to be going to uh, the store, grab some food for this young, lo uh, young, lovely Leon later right here. And uh, my son's going to be joining us as well, E-Bike Kid. So without further ado, we're going to go ahead and uh, get to ride. We're going to turn this bad boy on. And then I'm going to tell you, I'm going to show you what we're going to be doing to it. So let's go. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and turn the uh, turn the bike on. It's full. It's still fully charged. And um, so, a lot of people was thinking about you know, if I had this thing on pedal assist five, it would have went faster. But that is not the case for this stuff bomber. You can have it on pedal assist one, and it's still gonna max out the top speed, no matter if you have it on one, uh, two, three, four, or five. It's still going to max out. I can put it on one. Hold on. I can put this on one and it still have acceleration. So, I mean, it's still going to go at top speed. But for people that don't believe me, I'm just going to just put it on five so we can go ahead and uh, let's see, four or five. Okay, there we go. So, this was a little bit. Uh, has a little more uh, responsive though. All right, let's get on. Off. So it feels crazy though. I can tell you that right now. Yeah, I know, right? So, anyways, what's going on is that we are building a battery. Uh, we're going to have a controller as well, so the battery is going to be a 20S16, uh, no, 20S13P. Uh, we're actually uh, going to, it's going to be at 40 amp hours, and we're actually going to uh, put a different controller on here. I have no idea what kind of controller. I know it's not a square wave, not square wave, but a sine wave controller, because I can hear the gears clunking. Um, it feels like the... Uh, the 5000 Hawk motor, it has gears on it, so. So definitely not a sine wave controller. Maybe a, maybe a 100 amp controller, 150. But it does have some good acceleration. So we're gonna go ahead and um, rod. Um, I don't have much battery life on the GoPro, so hopefully, so hopefully, uh, Y'all, I can catch you some uh, video uh, footage for y'all. I just did. I just got off a did a live session uh, on that battery that I'm building for this particular bike. So it's gonna be uh, a night and day difference uh, once we get that bad boy tuned. Are we going straight? Okay. So we're turning. Come on, let's go. So we're turning. We're going up. riding on Main Street. How we do this all the time as well. There's a uh, oh say so we're slowing down. Okay we're making a right. Okay, okay. So we're telling the quarter just to get right there. I do say this the suspension is pretty good on these uh, stuff bombers. You're going pretty slow Maria you gotta go a little faster than this. All right, let's go. We're riding. So yeah, we're booking it. I say we're doing about 28 miles an hour right now. Well, about 30, not about 30 miles an hour. So I guess we're gonna cross the highway and then we're gonna make a, uh, make a left. Um, the owner did say, okay, we're gonna slow down. Okay, all right, we're slowing down. All right. All right, go, oh, hold on. All right. All right, ready? All right, off 
We go. Go ahead, son. Go. But then it kind of is, uh, flat lines at middle range. Like it just slowly ramps up the speed. Um, I notice it. So I guess we're going to go ahead and cross the highway. We're going to go down here to the intersection and then cross over to the Jamaican place, you know. So I'm going to let her know to go all the way down. All right, ready? Hold on. All right. All right, go ahead. Shoot on up though. Come on. Ah, come on. Where meet y'all, y'all? All right, we're gonna go through Publix right quick. All right, go that way. All right, thank you. Come on, let's go. Come on. All right. Got to get my kid here with me. Keep going. Right here. Right there. All right, so we had actually had to make our way to Burger King because of the simple fact that the Jamaican place was closed. So no curry, goat, or uh, chicken, or whatever you know. What I'm saying I'm not, I'm not making fun of that. I just, um, I had that stuff before, you know what I'm saying. But I like the the red velvet cake, so that's the reason why I like going there because they make some of the best red velvet cake I ever, I ever tasted. Uh, also uh, compared to my sisters too. Anyway, so we are actually here. But anyway, let's go ahead and discuss what I'm going to be doing with the stuff bomber. So, as uh, we know, we're going to be taking that panel off. We're going to be seeing what kind of battery control there is. And then we're going to be uh, outfitting new brakes on this thing. Now, my thing is, uh, once I put this uh, battery in, I want to know if I'm, if I'm going to be able to mount the controller either inside inside the compartment or can I mount it outside, you know, where this is, um, you know, where the wires and everything located. It looks like I might not be able to do that. I will find out uh, when we get uh, the battery and everything out and actually make that battery for this bike because uh, this bike is going to be producing a lot more power. Uh, we're going to be putting a 4 driver 72530 on this stuff bomber with a 20S 13P configuration uh, of a total DC lineups of about 455. The 72530. Uh, takes in a maximum of 350 amps so that that battery is going to be uh, more than suitable for this stuff bomber build that we're going to be doing so that's what i'm um going to be doing later on down the road actually on my live sections i i was doing a battery build for this particular bike so let's see here uh the suspension is pretty good i am pretty uh, pleased with the suspension on these bikes um this is not really my uh, my cup of tea, you know what I'm saying? I like my DIY builds uh, more than these uh, stuff bombers. But uh, since me riding this bike, I haven't got any encounters with the uh, police. So, I mean, they haven't been messing with us with these stuff bombers. Uh, I don't know because of the pedals or, you know what I'm saying, it doesn't look like a dirt bike because there's no motor, there's no sound to it, you know, just all the electric. But anyways, I'm going to let them get uh, where they want at Burger King and we're going to be going uh, back to the house. Look at that. Yeah, man, we ain't got but 31% on the GoPro. So if it goes dead, then I'm about to cut the bill right there. So we're using Jacoy's little where the gas tank at to actually hold the uh, Burger King food and the drink. So DoorDash. Yeah, so basically DoorDash. <laughs> all right. So here we go. Now the direction we're gonna go, we go all the way down um, 64. We gonna hit the back road to on um, Main Street. All right. All right, turn on the display. I wonder if that thing comes up by itself. Okay, so it doesn't come by itself, so I do got to hit the menu button. Okay, all right, we're on. All right, let me put my phone 
and my uh up under my shirt my pants because i definitely don't want that fall out all right here we go let's go went back on the stuff bummer again and boy right here so we're going to do a before and after so i already been i rode this stuff on already i think the top speed is like uh 60 miles an hour so we're gonna go ahead we gotta go be flying you can fly now son all right we're gonna make a right turn huh what what you say now yeah <laughs> yeah grass what no he'll be in the, oh he want on this side he good come on I know, I see it. All right, so we got make sure they're uh, make sure they're good. Come on, son. Cause this stuff on is pretty fast. I mean, not, yeah, this stuff on is pretty fast, and then the race is pretty fast as well. Come on, this way. Come on. Yeah, right here. All right, come on, let's go, let's go. stays on until I get home though but it's like it's doing pretty good hey what's up yep all right so we're going to keep on mushing forward all right ready let's go come on So I just passed the uh, county sheriff. They ain't really seen nothing. So I guess it's uh, it's cool to have a step farmer now. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yes, yeah, sir. All right. So you going on a ride? She's going to be all of us home. Come on, Coy. Slow down here and wait on them to come up. Going on. All right. Hey, everybody keep wondering, man, how you uh everybody keep asking me about you. Like, so I'll be doing my live streams, like, man, how's how's the rider, man? How's the rider? I'm like, he's all right, he's working. Yeah. I almost met in the metal. Who? You? Me? Yeah. And the way the way it sounds like. Okay, so uh, I think I'll make this to make more part one of the stuff bomber 
uh, let's see, a transformation uh, per se. So that was just a little bit of rod session of this step bomber, 5,000 watt clone. And we're gonna go ahead and get into the nitty gritty and go ahead and build the battery, get the controller done and the brakes. So we're gonna see how fast this bad boy can do after the transformation. But anyway, so stay tuned for part two of the Steph Bomber transformation. This is your boy, the e by Guy, and I'll see y'all in the next one.